Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to add collapsible product description section in Shopify. Before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering, how do you do this? How do you add a collapsible, collapsible product description? Well, adding one is fairly easy, but we need to access a few things and edit a few things here, but it can be overwhelming, but I'll be guiding you how to do that exactly. So first things first is you want to go to your Shopify's admin page or your uh, uh, dashboard here. And what we need to do here is we need to go to sales channel, want to go to online store and you want to go to teams. Now in here, instead of going to customize, we need to click on the three dotted option here. Let's go and click on the three dotted option. And you wanna go ahead and click on the option that says edit code. Now in here, what we need to do next is we need to look for a very specific file here, which in this case is going to be the sections. Let's, uh, let's go to the sections folder. And you wanna look for the option that says main product dot liquid. In this case, you want to scroll down a bit here until you see a main product. So once you see it, double click on it. And from here, it should open up the actual file. Now, what we need to do here is we first need to have a original copy of your uh, liquid file here, which in this case allows us to back up just in case we like we do something wrong. You can still get the original uh, code that we have. Let's go and copy the whole thing, pressing on the section here and clicking on control A on your keyboard and control C to copy your text. Now let's go open up any notepad here. Let's go and paste our code. And from here, we're now ready to start adding our collapsible product description. Now, what you need to do here is you need to look for a very specific section. So in this case in your liquid file here, you wanna go ahead and press control F on your keyboard. So make sure you have it or you have your file here selected first. And from here, you wanna go to find you want to look for the option or the text here that says when description once you've added that you know you don't you need to click on the next option and you should be able to see this small section here now just to give you some description here or some explanation the section that says when description actually contains the details or the code for our description so in this case let me just go to another tab here just to give you an idea and I wanna go ahead and open up my store here and I wanna open up one of the products that I have. So in this case, for example, our description, this is what it actually looks like. So by default, it's not collapsible. So let me actually go back into our code here. You'll have the option to change this, but what we are going to change here is going to be the div section here. In this case, what do we enter or what do we do here? Well, in this case, we actually have a code that we could paste here that we could use to uh, alter the look of our description. Now, by the way, we'll, we'll be adding this into our description. So make sure to check out our description. So in this case, it's going to copy the whole thing here. Control C to copy the whole thing here. And it's going to go back into our file. Again, you want to highlight the whole thing here. You want to go and delete or press on backspace and you want to go and start pacing this. So control V. Now in here, what we need to do is we need to align this properly. So this is just for aesthetic purposes is I want this aligned properly here. And from here, we should be able to uh, basically save this. But in some cases, if you do see the option or the section here that has icon carrot, uh, has like that, that red underline here. What you could do here is you could just basically remove this section. This, uh, by the way, just give you uh, this, a short description here. This is just an icon that actually indicates that, hey, this is a collapsible description. So in this case, if you want to replace this with a different one, uh, you, you could go ahead and do that. But in my case, uh, this actually doesn't work. So I want to remove it. But then again, you could replace this with another icon if you have one. But yeah, so let's just remove this. It's not working. And once we've done that, let's go and click on save at the top right here. And from here, once we actually go back into our product, so just again, this is the original look here. And once we actually reload our page here, as you can see, this is what it looks like. So in this case, our description is amazing. But the thing here is whenever you click on description, it should open up our description now. Now, like what I said before, usually if a collapsible uh, description usually has like an icon next to it. Now, what we just remove is the icon for that. So if you want to use the specific one, you could go and replace the icon carrot here. But this is just an option that you could do. But in my case, I just want to remove this. 
And uh, yeah, so let's just click on make sure that we save this one. But once you've saved that, you should now have a collapsible description. So this one is fairly easy as long as you follow the on-screen steps. But from here on, you should be good. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.